The YWCA broke ground today on a new shelter that will serve countless women who have experienced domestic violence. It may not look like much now, but the shelter will officially open this fall. With that, construction is officially underway. In a matter of months, this empty lot will be home to a brand new emergency shelter for victims of domestic violence. The rise in domestic violence during COVID is very alarming to us because it's not subsided. Partner and family member assaults rose nearly 40% during the COVID-19 pandemic. Sexual assaults also rose 40%. This new shelter right next door, the YWCA's existing Gateway Emergency Shelter, will include 25 rooms with 66 beds for victims seeking refuge, as well as counseling offices, food pantry, laundry areas, and indoor and outdoor family areas. And then as they start to recover from their trauma, we're able to provide them services here on the campus that include legal services, um, financial counseling, finding housing. In the last two years, we found housing for 450 families. The two-story shelter is expected to open next fall. $2.9 million of the $4 million needed for the building has already been raised. It's a facility that's expected to save countless lives when it opens. In Billings, Matthew Hidalgo, MTN News.